Welcome back. So today we are going to be taking a look at WGEL. Wiggle. Wiggle. Whatever you want to call it. Go ahead and copy the IP address. Start up a MMAP scan here. I was just messing with the Windows machine. Might do that after this guy. We'll see. So uh, clear both of those. Make a directory for WGO. CD into there. I'll CD into there down here. They got the same size. And let's go ahead and start up an MMAP scan. Tap P, tack all ports. Tack VV, very verbose. Timing to four, one above the default. No DNS lookup and do not ping. All right, so we do have a port 80 here. Let's go ahead and check him out like, real quick. See what we got. Uh, default Apache page. So we'll let that guy keep going, see if we see anything else with him. Let's also start up a Nikto scan on him. HTTP. There we go. And let's go ahead and do a Go Buster also on him. Dir attack you. HTTP. Attack W. We'll say user share wordless dir B. We'll go with big dot text. See if we get anything with that guy right there. Let's also manually enumerate. See if we have a robot in here or anything like that. Robots.txt. Nothing in robots. Okay. So we'll let these guys go since that's all we're seeing so far is port 80 and 22. Um, I'm not. Tac P80 for that IP address. Tac SC, Tac SV. For the IP address, run default scripts and see if we can figure out a version. See what's going on with this thing. Yep, it's an Apache page definitely it works. There's an Apache default page. That thing is right. Search exploit for Apache 2.4. Got anything with that? 2.4.1 or 2.4.18 17 okay All right, that's for PHP Let's see here this guy doesn't seem to be finding much like right here he's still looking down here probably should have raised the threads up like a little bit huh Well, let's have some fun with it. Let's throw a zap at it. Zap. See if zap can find anything. Zap it up. I'm going to attack him. See if we get anything in here. See if there's a site map. Show us different things. Not found, okay. That's why I see. We got an icons, a bunch of page icon. Uh doesn't really look like we're getting much, huh? And still not seeing much down here either. I don't know, maybe it's more of a CTF style. Maybe we use something like a 2.3 medium.txt or some of that. Maybe we need to do a vhost. I don't know. I guess we'll find out. Get head post and options. Nothing strange going on up there. Let this guy let this guy go. See what happens with him. Still nothing, huh? That's crazy. Just for a default page. Let's go ahead and run another GoBus scan. Hopefully, it doesn't break it. Go Buster, Dirt Attack, U, HTTP, 
not thing check w user share word list uh derby maybe and then no it's der yeah derby right is that right nope der buster 2.3 medium dot text try something like that tack t we'll say 200 200 threads we do have a site map You unapp template, okay. Take on your biggest projects and goals. Huh. Okay, so we got this thing called Slight Map here. That's different. Get premium. Not found. Alright. Services. Dot HTML, okay. It's good to know. Blog. about shop I want to maybe do something against this guy like right here get in touch does it have an email address in here info at your site .com, your site no okay nothing crazy in here do we have any type of well we'll see if we have any type of cross-site script or anything like that so I want to see if we even get cookies just for showing up here no we don't get any session cookies here okay you go to Chrome. Use Chrome for that. Why'd you do that? Much rather use uh. I like looking at cookies more on Firefox. I feel like it's easier to look at it. Let's go and check out the site map. See what's going on there. Or we could just break Cali. There we go. Um. Go Buster Dur Tack You. User share word list Dur Buster Dur Buster Directory list 2.3 medium not text. We'll go with that. Tac T 200 again. Hopefully we don't break the web page doing this. Images CSS JS. Got fonts in there. Let's see if we can look at the JavaScript for it. Looking at if it's a mobile or not. A lot of stuff happening here, huh? Website's built built pretty hardcore. Let's go ahead and check out um or we just break Cali again. I don't know what the heck's going on with Cali like right now. There we go. Let's um do we get anything else in here? Yeah, we're breaking them, that's what else we got. Peter? Is that something? Or is this like our broke? Alright, we're breaking this guy, huh? Let's go and stop it down here. Okay, so Peter is not... That's not an actual thing. Okay, let's go ahead and go back to here. Control U. See if we got anything in here. Any type of comments or anything like that. This is an easy box. I don't think it's going to be too, anything too hardcore. Well, they're supposed to be going there, supposedly. Product detail, HTML floral dress. What do we got here? I'm not seeing any products up here. What do we got? Okay, we got these images down here. Can we add something to the cart? How do we do that? Shop. Floral dress. I saw you show about 20 times. Can we go to cart? Do we actually have a cart? I don't see a cart anywhere. Okay, that doesn't do anything. Can we look at it. Um, we open a new tab. No. 
Nothing like that. Okay, so nothing in there. I don't see anything in here. I might want to head up, head back over to Zap maybe, and see if we can get something with this guy over here. See if we see anything. Slight map fix. Yeah, I broke this guy, huh? He's looking pretty rough, like right now, isn't he? Okay, so he found site map, but scrolling through them quickly, not really seeing anything else that he found. I was like, hey, go here. I mean, he also died a hundred times, so that might not really be a good uh, indicator of anything. Hopefully, if this guy finds something, we'll find out here in a second. Hopefully. I um, think site map, has, site map has a robots.txt maybe? I feel like we already saw that in the very beginning, huh? Nothing with robots.txt and site map, okay. May not be on the correct site at all. We have no idea. Didn't really see anything with comments. Anything with comments on this page? Nothing. No. Uh, Jesse, don't forget to update the website. Okay. We got something. We got usually we got Jesse. So we have a username, potential username now. Nano, we can just echo Jesse into users.txt. So that's good. Nothing. Services. Something here. I'm also not seeing anywhere to log in at. If we do like a slash admin or something like that. Sitemap slash admin. Nope. Slash login. Nope. Okay. So I'm not seeing any logins over here also. So, but we're able to buy stuff. We have a cart. I'm going to check out that site map again because we found the most stuff at least within site map so far. And then it started going insane. Which is my own fault. Jesus. Christ, buddy. You just can't send 200 threads at it, maybe. Try with 100. And let's also go ahead and do a zap on him also but I broke again attack them make sure we're not losing stuff over here let's keep working on this guy Site map, there we go. Okay, we got get about blog contact. Yep, CSS, nothing crazy going on there. Gallery images, nothing. JavaScript, okay, we know all that. Shop.html, so nothing really crazy that we see yet going on here, huh? We just see the site map so far. Okay, sitemap XML, we can see what that is. Let's go ahead and try to open that up in a new browser. See if that's something, see if we get some usernames or something like that in there. 
Nothing in there, okay. So it should be HTTP also, not HTTPS. Oh, is HTTPS going to open up like that, huh? Alright, so nothing so far in here. Hmm. Got him going on it. We can always try a Nikto scan with the site map. HTTP 1010.158.66.158.66 slash site map. I'll try that like right there. And only port 22 and 80 look like they're open. So nothing crazy going on over there. See if we have anything for tasks or anything like that. I don't think so. I think it's just user. Yep, user and root flag. That's it. So nothing crazy in there also for, you know, or nothing that can really lead us in the correct direction over there. User and root flag sitting there. So now we're just kind of just kind of waiting, huh? These are all 301, so well, so you're not going to be able to get into those. Okay. Never mind. Dashboard about. Loader. Okay, so this isn't going anywhere crazy like right here. Like file equals or anything like that. Although I didn't see a lot of these pictures. Or if we start reading those blogs. I wonder if there's actual blogs on here. Yes, there are. Dave Miller, Dave Miller, Dave Miller. Okay. We got a guy that wrote a lot of blogs. Okay, so these are these blogs aren't actually going anywhere. Okay. Thank God. Huh. huh. That is very, very strange. Thank you very much for the foul for Ellie Hop. Uh, what's up? If you had done this box before, or is this blind? Oh, this is blind. I don't know. I've never done this one. Usually, about 90% of the time, I go through them blind. Some people like it. Others don't. Sometimes my Kelly Linux machine just dies. You know, it all depends on what's going to happen that day. Sass. What is Sass. Okay. Nope, nothing in there. Theme mixins. That's just the web page, all that information there. Fonts, we don't have anything crazy in here, right? There's nothing crazy in fonts or anything like that. No. Nothing in there. There's not that not that I, anything that points out to me, like use this. I don't know why Kelly keeps doing that also, why he keeps doing this like little like freeze thing. I don't know what that sass is. IP address found location header that IP is 127.0.1.1. I'm sure it is. Uh, let's see if Zap found anything else. Zap still contact. Uh, yep, Zap hasn't found anything. That is super weird. Hmm.
Five medium alerts. Directory browsing. Huh? Yeah, I saw that. Marvel JavaScript library, but we're not getting any type of as far as I know, we're not getting any type of um credentials for it, like a session log or anything like that. We're not getting anything like that. Cookies. That's for Zap. That's old YouTube. Nothing. Okay, so we're not getting any type of credential logins here. We're not getting any type of type of cookies or session ID or anything like that. Let's try to spider it. See what we get with that. Okay, so that finished super quick. Still nothing, huh? That is weird. All this stuff. Go ahead and delete all that stuff. From all the Google callbacks. Delete him. Delete him again. There's site map like right there. We're not getting really much from him, huh? Come back over in here. We're not getting anything from this guy either. Sharma, how you doing? I got news. Oh, what's your news? What'd you do? <laughs> I need a drum roll if you want. There's your drum roll. Um, I'm not seeing anything on this guy. There's nothing on this guy. Well, that we can tell like right now. Um, There's nothing here. Okay. Should we use big dot text? Should we use to try a different word list for it? Because I'm not seeing anything for this guy right here. So I submitted my master's dissertation this week and officially I've completed my master's degree sometime back. I was even speculating to drop out of the last semester, but thanks to my friends who persuaded me in the right way and thanks to the local one for inspiration and motivation. I do feel relieved now. There's tons of Tons of load is off my back. Spot. Yeah, it's awesome. Like, remember you uh, completed, isn't it? Awesome job. Congratulations. Congratulations, man. That is awesome. I wonder if this is like one of those ones where I want you to use like a certain word list. I've had those guys before. It's a little bit annoying. Not a little bit. I mean like a lot of it. So that's all we're seeing so far. We're not seeing anything else so far. Um, I don't know. Maybe try use big dot text. Okay, we have a dot ssh with big dot text. We check that out, like right there. We have an idrsa key. The only username we have so far is Jesse. So is this Jesse's IDRSA key? Um, let's go ahead and nano IDRSA. Change mode 600 IDRSA. Okay, so he found that one immediately. So. Oh, nice, dude. You're, you're freaking, and you got a job. Awesome job, man. That is freaking awesome, dude. Complete your master's. Got a job offer? That is freaking awesome, man. Good, congratulations. 
Sage Tech I IDRs. That is awesome. That, that, that really is. That is awesome. That's some that, that's a lot of weight off your shoulders, like right there. That is some amazing stuff. Congratulations. Alright, well that IDR is A key worked with Jesse. Uh, let's go ahead and cat scripts. Uh, we'll do um that's your ID lookup. See if we got anything in here. We'll try a sudo tech out. We don't have his password, but we can always try it. XOR wrap. PPPD. That's been PPPD. Anybody know what that is? That's been PPPD. That's a new one for me. PPPD. Okay, well, it's not. Okay. Uh, mount pink six. Unmount sudo. Mount. Everything else in here looks pretty normal except for some of these guys over here but let's go ahead and do a sudo tech l see if we can run anything out here we don't have this password so i highly doubt it but we can give it a try oh we can okay we can run w get as root okay w get as sudo we can run it so can we just do a how are we going to run this guy so we can run a we can run it as sudo, right? So shouldn't we just be able to get a file? Can we download like Etsy Shadow or something like that? Or can we just grab like the root flag or something? You know what I'm saying? Like I, I feel like we just do like a wget and just grab like the root flag file or something like that. I don't know. Let's um, let's. Freaking, let's do a ls tech la first. Let's see what is it called root.txt? Because it definitely has a user.txt in there, right? See so if you need a desktop. Otherwise, do that. Um, see if you need documents. User underscore flag dot text. This guy. I mean, he's obviously a Linux machine. It just looks like a Windows machine up there, doesn't it? So maybe it's root underscore flag dot text. Something like that, maybe. Let's try. Let's throw this into here. See, that's the flag. All right, let's go. There we go. Reverse shell with wget and then bash. Okay. And then we'll run as sudo, obviously. So you're saying to do a... Let me see here. So what you're saying to do is something like a... Um, like a sudo wget and then grab a reverse shell from me and then run it. Is that what you're saying? Well, let's see here. We have. Where the heck did it go? There we go. All file equals file save. Oh, sudo. Okay. URL equals fetch a remote file via HTTP. The binary is allowed to run as super user by sudo. It does not drop the elevated privileges and may be used to access the file system. Escalate or maintain privileged access. So you're saying maybe do a. I mean, obviously has bash on there. So let's make sure that a bash reverse shell works first. Going cat scripts bash reverse shell. Let's go ahead and grab this guy. I have config. We'll do it 10, 13, 26, 184. Okay, so that bash reverse shell definitely works. Okay, so we got that. So let's go ahead and get a Python server up and running. 
PHP.server. And let's go ahead and create, I guess, a bash file. Like, um, so we can go ahead and do a nano shell.txt or shell.sh, um, right? To create that bash script, right? Let's go ahead and grab this. Whoops. And then we'll do a bang bin bash, right? Yep. Okay, add that in there, to actually just enter, and what are you saying, just kind of just get it? Let's see here. So URL equals that, that sudo w get URL tackle L file. Okay, so let's try it. URL equals p 10.13.26.184. L file is file to save. I feel like it's going to be shell.sh, right? Just do it like that. And then we just do a sudo wget. And then we should just be able to do a dollar sign URL, right? Connection refused. Okay. Let's try to do this. 10, 13, 26, 24. That should be the IP address, right? Yep, okay. Let's do that. Then let's do L file equals shell.sh. Then we'll do a sudo wget dollar sign URL tag O dollar sign L file. Oh, it's also on 48,000. Why is it running on 48,000? Change URL to what I had before. Shell.sh. Oh, well, we grabbed it twice. It is being ran as root. So can we now just listen? And maybe do a period slash shell where we got change mode plus X, right? Oh, I should have did a slash uh, underscore bash, huh? That's what you're saying. Or I should do a pipe bash, huh? So we should do a pipe bash to have it run right. No, that didn't do anything for us. That's not going to work for us. Um, well, we should be able to. So we can download it, but it downloads as root, right? So we can do that. Um, should we do a pipe bash in here? Because now we got to make it run, right? So should we do a. Nothing in there. Can we do something wget tag tag out? Can we send a file to me through wget? Wget help rep for post. Use post to say contents of file. Yeah, we can send the contents of the file back to me. So you can always try to send root.txt back to me or like Etsy shadow back to me. Right? Send string as the dev. Can we do that? Or can we have it run it as it downloads it? Uh, 
Carl W. W, yep, I mean, we got that. Might be able to do a post file and have it send back to us. No DNS cache. Retry cache refused. Okay, let's try it with wget tac q tac o. You think that's what? You think it will do that? So you're saying wget and then you're saying tac q. What does tac q do? Tac lowercase q, tac q, tac o. Say it like that. Probably do the whole URL thing, huh? Missing URL, but we're not. <laughs> Write documents to file. Alpha file, log message file, tech Q, quiet. I don't think that's going to do anything for us. Why do you keep saying that you don't have a URL? Alright, so we got, well, we're Jesse again. So we downloaded it, but we're Jesse again. Let's see if we, I don't know why I just typed that in. Um, I'm obviously Jesse. Why, why can't I think of the command? And we are not in the AMID group. So let's go ahead and try. I got another idea. Let's go ahead and do a um, root underscore flag w get. And we're going to grep for post. So post files. So we're going to do w get tac tac post file. Shadow.txt. Let's start up a listener over here. Uh, post file. We'll do slash Etsy shadow. Etsy shadow. I think that should work right there. W get post file. Let's see here. Um, I don't know if I need to put like quotations or anything like that, but we can try that. Um, that should be a post file equals Etsy shadow and then we from here we're going to put in our IP address with like wherever the listeners at so our IP address HTTP 10 13 permission denied sudo Okay, so that dropped the Etsy shadow to us, right? So we might just be able to just drop. Okay, so we can't log in with root. May just be able to just drop root.txt then. Thank you very much. So the other one was called user underscore dot text, right? User flag dot text. Let's try slash root slash root underscore flag dot text. 
Starved listener again over here. And this should send the data to me. Let's go! Who needs GTFO bins? I do. No, 100%. Don't, don't, don't turn on that site. Let's interpret the URL file path, guys. That's what I did. Oh, nice. Nice, Frank. Very nice. So let's, uh, we can do that. And then let's throw it into WGEL. And there we go. I think it took longer for us to find that .ssh. That took forever. All right. Let's go. There we go. There's one. There's one down. Um, 